guys, this is Spartan 117GW. I'm uh, welcoming a couple of special guests. We have Jet Desert Fox behind the camera and Level Cap running behind me, patrolling the area. Uh, what I have is a beautiful, beautiful evolution of the gas blowback rifle in Airsoft. This is the PTS Mega Arms. Now this thing is a beauty. Now we've had go glass blowback uh, weapons on the market, but what's so great about it is that it's, it just has a one piece upper, very, very solid mil spec Picatinny rails. Well, key thing, mil spec key mod rail system. Very excellent because you can definitely tell there's bevels in there that show that they've really gone an extra mile to make it mil spec, therefore being compatible with all the key mod products that are out there today. It also comes with these iron sights, which is kind of the old school A2 sights, but what's great is that they're actually uh, screwed on, so you can definitely uh, remove them if you don't need to. I kind of like the, uh, the A-frame style front sight post. It's kind of a good reference point when you're doing a re reflexive fire, uh, but that's why I prefer to use it. I'm also using the uh, Airsoft Extreme uh, um, Micro Red Dot with High Profile Riser. It's a really good optic and has really good MOA uh, consistent dot size. We also have the Gr uh, Griffin uh, Armament um, Muzzle Comp on here. It doesn't come with the gun, but it's a nice accessory that kind of helps with the aesthetic of the look. <clears throat> the magazine is the standard uh, KWA 40 round magazines. Uh, so that's why it's compatible with other uh, gas pullback weapons that you may have previously owned. One thing that's really cool too is it also comes with the crane stock. So, um, and it has a couple other features as well, including a skeletonized trigger. Um, and it also has a, uh, I guess you could say, uh, enhanced trigger guard built into the lower receiver. It has excellent trademarks that everything's laser engraved and the body, it really is a step above the previous generation. Um, I mean, out of the box for 480, compared to the previous generation, you're getting a lot more for your money. And keep an eye on this too. Um, I was shooting with 0.28 and it was getting a 350 with a, uh, F, with a hop up adjusted, which means it's probably gonna be closer to about 400, 410 FPS. So it's a little hot, more for fields than for CQB, but you can probably modify it with existing uh, different low power bolts that are on the market as well. But as you can see, it has a nice length barrel here and I'm just gonna demonstrate this real quick. But as you can see, very awesome weapon system. All right, so we just took out level cap. Hope he, he had me dead to rights, but I got him. It was a cool thing too. But make sure you guys check it out. It's gonna be at SHOT Show, and there's probably gonna be a lot of coverage post uh, SHOT Show as well. The PTS Mega Arms, a really awesome platform. Uh, make sure you guys check it out. It's a really good evolution of the gas blowback rifle. So make sure you guys uh, keep an eye out for it. Thank you guys for watching. This is Spartan 117GW. Oh, safety, Greg. I'm hit! I'm hit! Ugh. I'm hit! I'm hit! Ugh. Cut it well, Charlie! I'm checking your left! Right there, dude, you seriously gonna have to get He hit? He's hit. We got a whole bunch on the red side. Alright. I'm just checking your left real quick. Alright.
like you're buying Charlie dinner. What's up? I didn't hit you, did I? I think one winged me. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Um, well, the camera is ready. James C. Burns play Sergeant Frank Woods in Call of Duty Black Ops 1 and 2. It's time for you to subscribe to Spartan 117GW, baby. Elite Force BB, that's what's in my mag. Thanks for watching.